Hello everybody, uh, welcome back to another What Ups Rants, and today I'm going to be ranting about how, or I'm ranting in defense of Survivor and kind of in defense of Rick Devins. So, uh, for the Survivor part, people have been saying there's way too many idols, there were 8 idols used this season, which is one less than the, than the season that was probably one of the worst seasons, at least for fan-wise. Uh, heroes versus hustlers versus healers, which had nine idols used. And uh, in defense of Survivor, first of all, uh, they did have the twist Edge of Extinction, which gave the person who returned one idol or half an idol. So if we take that out, there were only six idols used, which is the same as some other iconic seasons of Survivor, and which makes it kind of just a normal season. Kind of just a normal amount of idols used. You know, there's usually around five to six idols used per season. And, or at least for the newer generation of Survivor, usually five to six idols are used. And uh, in defense of Survivor, without, the tw without this twist, it's just six idols. Now, six idols may seem a lot to you, but it's, it's the same amount of some iconic seasons such as Survivor Kageon and Survivor Heroes vs. Villains. And I have this list in uh, the Survivor Wiki of hidden, immun hidden immunity idols used per season. And uh, as you can see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. There was 8 idols used. Without the two edge people, there's only 6 idols used. Or not used, but 6 idols obtained. And who knows, without Rick Devons, there might have been less. So then, let's go to a season before it. David versus Goliath. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There were seven idols and David versus Goliath. And remember, this is without the edge twist. So there's already one more idol more than in than in um Survivor Edge of Extinction. And this season I didn't hear a lot of complaining about idols. Not even advantages with the So this has seven idols. Even with the idol block, and I believe an extra vote by Nick. Yeah, I think, yeah, extra vote and the idol block. No one really complained about advantages, probably because they're used more scatteredly around. But, or in favor of the Davids, which everyone loved, or most of the people loved. So, yeah, no one really complained, but people really complained about this season because of Rick Devins. So remember, seven above. So this has one idol above Edge of Extinction without the two idols, without the Edge Twist. So now we have Dave Ghost Island. One, I believe, okay, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. So Ghost Island has six. Now it does have that Ghost Island Twist, which probably takes out like one, I believe, or two. I, I forget how many idols were found in Ghost Island. So you can take it away, but... If you didn't take it away, it has the same amount of idols as Edge of Extinction without the two edge twists. Without the two edge idols. So now we have the iconic Heroes versus <laughs> Heroes versus uh Oh my gosh, I can't even think. Heroes versus Houses versus Heroes. I can't even I don't even remember if I said it right. Yeah, I did. Uh okay, so let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's nine idols used in Heroes vs. Houses vs. Hero Healers. And yeah, people did complain about a lot of idols, so I'll give people the credit for that one. That has one more idol more than the Edge Twist, which is crazy. So then, uh, Game Changers, about five idols, which is normal amount. Then we have Millennials vs. Gen X, I believe is also five idols. Three, two, yep, five idols, okay. Soko Rong, Cambodia, Worlds Apart, San Juan, I believe, only has four. Oh no, San Juan Duster has five. So now we have Kageon. One, two, three, four, five, six. So Kageon has six idols, the same amount as Edge of Extinction, without the two edge twist. I mean, without the two edge idols, not the two edge twist, I'm sorry. Okay, so now we have Caramone. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so it's normal five. So now let's keep going. And I believe 
there's one more season where it has six. Yep, like one of the best seasons ever, Heroes vs. Villains. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six idols used in Heroes vs. Villains. The same amount of idols found in Edge of Extinction without the two Edge idols. And I always say without the two Edge idols because without the twist, it's just the normal amount of idols in Survivor. And people complain so much about, Sir, you can, you can, a good argument would be, there shouldn't have been idols after you made it through Edge of Extinction. And sure, that might be true or false. But, a worse argument is to say that there was too many idols in Survivor. Because this season had the same amount as idols as any other season. As any other, like, a season like Heroes vs. Villains or Kageyan. It's just that, with the twist, it gave the person who returned an idol. So, if you made an argument saying that the people who returned shouldn't get an idol, then sure, that's a valid point. Shouldn't get their half idol. Or even it is, it is a half idol. So, you still have to give it to someone and trust they give it to you. But, obviously, both times it worked out in the person's favor. And it could not. It might have bit their butt. So, you don't even know if that even works. It's still a risk. But, sure, you can even say that they shouldn't have gotten that half idol. And then, I believe that that should defend Survivor enough. You, I'm pretty sure no one can make an argument against that. Unless you say that idols, and I, I think this is a false a false uh, argument that idols shouldn't be, placed back, shouldn't be placed back after it's used. And I disagree. If someone's on the bottom and they have no way out, it's either individual immunity or idol. And it's, it's always been that way. It's always been, or not before their idols not used, or before their uh before idols were not in the game. Obviously, that wasn't a problem. But since idols have been in the game, it's always been that once someone uses it, it's put back into the game. At least for the newer generation of Survivor seasons. So, just because the season Rick Devins found more than usual, and it was eight idols used, but because of the edge idols, it's only six, which is normal normal amount. And then, in defense of Rick, what is he supposed to do? Because he found idols, like, you're going to bash his name? He still played a good game. One of, the, one of the best games this season. I don't know if it's the best. I don't know if it's... I know for sure it's one of the best games this season. And is it his fault that Survivor puts idols back after each idol is used? Is it his fault that he finds them? It's really not his fault. What is he supposed to do? And you shouldn't bash Rick Devon's name. Or you shouldn't... I've seen a lot of people just call him like fucking horrible things. Just because he found these idols. And that's completely false. That should not happen. And you can bash his name. You can bash his game. But he did what he had to do to, to get past... To get further into the game. He won individual immunities. And when he did it, he used what his survivor knowledge of when idols are replayed. They're put back into the game. And he found idols. And other people didn't. And other people could have also... Uh, could have also done what they did to Aubrey. Gavin and Victoria could have done what they did to Aubrey. Now obviously this didn't happen. And you couldn't complain about the idols. But I don't think you should complain about the idols this season. But you can complain. The only argument you can make is that... The Edge of Extinction returnees should not get an, half an idol. And... Uh, I, I don't know if I agree or disagree... I kind of agree what Survivor did. It gave them half an idol. But if you disagree, then that's fine. It was eight idols used a season. Six without the edge idols, which is normal. Which is almost the same amount. It's usually five or six used. Sometimes not even that much. But uh, same amount of idols used without the edge idols as Heroes vs. Villains and Kageon. And one less than David vs. Goliath, the, pre the previous season. With an extra vote and idol block. But of course Aubrey had an extra vote. And Ron had a. Their weird scroll thing. I forgot it was like a shop. Which was never used. So yeah. I think if anyone wants to make an argument. Say in the comments or DM me. And I, I think I made my point really good. And maybe you have a better point. that I just It just flew over my head. So thank you for watching. Uh, if you want to debate me. Just DM me or comment. Thank you for watching.